In the name of the Father, the Son, the Holy Spirit, Amen. Our life is a spiritual battle until we die. We have to encounter three major enemies in our spiritual life, and they are the devil, the flesh, and the world. Let's talk briefly about how we can overcome the devil. First of all, we have to recognize that the devil really does exist. And St. Thomas Aquinas defines the devil as the tempter. St. Augustine says that the devil is like a angry dog on a chain or a leash. So we have to keep distance from the devil. St. Ignatius uh, calls the devil the enemy of our human nature. So today in our presentation, I'd like to talk about three ways that we can conquer temptation. First is we should try to avoid the near occasion of sin. Sometimes we end up by committing sin because we are in the near occasion of sin, and the devil can actually utilize our being placed near temptation to tempt us, to provoke us, to seduce us into falling into sin. Second is when, when we are tempted, we should call upon God for help. St. Joseph is known as the terror of demons. Call out to St. Joseph. Yesterday we talked about St. Michael the Archangel. Pray often that prayer to St. Michael the Archangel that was composed by Pope Leo XIII when he recognized that the uh, smoke of Satan was going to enter into the church. We see the smoke of Satan entering into the church, especially through homosexuality. And lastly, we want to conquer the devil. It's very important that we turn to Mary. Here we see Jesus in the arms of Mary. Mary's powerful. Mary, through her prayers, can crush the head of the devil. But never forget that the devil exists. But God is much more powerful than the devil. As the Bible teaches us, our help is in the name of the Lord, who made heaven and earth. If God is with us, who can be against us? Nothing is impossible with God. So recognize that all of us will be tempted in our lives until we die. But if we rely upon God and Mary and the angels and saints, we will win the victory. Amen.